doing a walk around on my 1974 Datsun 260Z. Today's date is January 4th, 2014. Uh, I'm going to do a body walk around first and show some of the minor imperfections in the paint. Uh, first off is right up here by the passenger side headlight bucket. I got a small chip and a little chip in here where it was blended together. Uh, car has hids and they're fully functional. The ballast, everything work. Turn signals in the grill area. Front air dam. Look down the driver's side. Fairly straight. Uh, the front fenders were bonded and blended into the side skirts. Uh, coming back on the car, up here by the rear driver's side, I got a small scratch in the paint. Back here on the rear end, you can see where the fiberglass was put on and some slight cracking where the fiberglass was blended together, where the rear bumper used to go. Rear light area. I got all the lights working except for the brake lights. Haven't found time to troubleshoot that yet. Hood in the rear deck. Passenger side. car is inky BBS style mesh wheels with 235, 50, 16 tires on it all the way around. Uh, show the interior now. Inside the rear hatch area, rear struts work. It's missing some caps over the rear struts, the covers. One of the places that these usually rust is in here, in the spare tire well. You can see when you lift up the carpet, it's fairly rust free on the inside. Spare tire well. The interior. Got the original dots and factory seats. Dots and steering wheel. Speed hut gauges with shift light and a GPS speedometer. Uh, if I turn the lights on, you can see that they work and the fader works. Uh, it's got a water temperature which works. All the gauges work. Oil pressure, which for some reason is sitting at 20. And the fuel gauge. Car has a switch for the fan. Uh, this is for the fader for the, for the lights. Uh, it's got a push button starter down here. It's got a diamond plate center console at this time with the shifter coming up. Uh, this is what I mean by the the shifter being at the wrong angle. It's too far over to the passenger side and you end up hitting your knuckles on the console on the dash when you shift it in the fifth gear. I've got some small imperfections in the passenger seat. Some rips. Uh, the door cards are in good shape. The only thing missing from the doors right now is the window cranks. But I have both of those in a Ziploc bag. In a Dash has got an overlay on it. These are notorious for cracking. Uh, up here you can see the GPS. Uh, antenna for the speedometer. No headliner. It's just uh, painted black on the steel.
take a little look at the engine right now. Uh, it's got a Chevy 350, four bolt main. And it's got a Holley Street Avenger carburetor. Mallory Unilite ignition with a box. This is the brake booster. It's got a slate vacuum leak in it. Master cylinder. Um, here's the headers. And it's got shorty headers on it with a dual exhaust. It's got an aluminum radiator with an electric fan. And that's about it for right now. Thanks for looking.